when you open the software, the big thing that you can see, in, it's go to the infinite, it's a ground. If you click on a ground, the sitting, the, the ground will be appear here, or you can <clears throat> click the ground from outliner from here. This is a ground. The ground, you can simply uh, move it, simply rotate it, but in this angle. Uh, this is a ground. If you play the game from here, you can see the object uh, hit the ground and does not go through that because it's automatically ground and it has a collision shape. Uh, you can change the name of ground, any name from here. You can change the position, the rotation of that. Uh, you can see better when we insert the texture from here. You can select the ground type. No ground. If you play with that, it means you can uh, create ground. You can see the object fall down to infinity. No ground. Grass. Simple road. You can see it has a road texture here no texture no texture if you set to the no texture if you play the game you can see we have a ground collision but you can change the color of the ground any color that you want that i choose also uh, always a dark ground to better seeing my game and also the ground contain start and the end uh, of the game it means uh, the game will be a start from from a start to the end the game will be happen in between them that you can expand them uh, to for example you have a runner game it's running this scene you have enemy you have road in between them or you have uh, 3d game that the uh, for example this is level one and then from here you can add another scene that you can see it's another scene start and you can set another enemy another character or anything that you want it's very simple or you can right click and delete that scene if you want start scene and i'll be explaining more and you can understand better so select the ground you can change the texture uh, texture scale and texture size let's insert our texture for doing that you can go into the custom texture going here you can drag and drop your texture here or you can navigate it uh, let's insert our simple pattern for example simply drag and drop it here nice be careful about the color the color override the texture of that make it as full bright now you can see your texture interesting you can change the scale of the texture you can oh in this case you cannot you can move it you can see if you want you can rotate it in any degree that you want you can scale it something like that but unfortunately, it does not have support normal or height map. You have to insert another 3D object that you want. Or you want to infinite texture offset. You can move the texture infinite. It's going to the infinite or not. Or you can change the length of that, the number that you want. Like that. You can see this is our area. But in this case, infinite is nice. Or from this part, you can deactivate that. Okay, I choose um, no texture with a simple color. Nice. So you can see we have our ground. We can play. Boom. and infinite okay let's make it again i think this software has a lots of little bug something like that you can click on here and choose 
uh, camera view something like that and play if you click the camera now you can see we are in the camera and we have this issue here it is no texture let's make it a custom texture this color okay that's it